The Black Lives Matter movement may have to ask for forgiveness. Los Angeles leaders are upset after a community meeting with the mayor last week went south and embarrassed many involved. We say today to Black Lives Matter of Los Angeles, do the right thing. We are not against you, but certainly you have offended not only a house of worship, but you have offended the entire faith-based community. Pastors and community leaders came together at Mount Moriah Baptist Church to call for an apology. They say members of the Black Lives Matter movement offended them at a meeting with Mayor Eric Garcetti last week. At the forum, protesters turned their backs to the mayor as he spoke and surrounded his car as he tried to leave. Unfortunately, things got out of hand, to say the least. The mayor sent out a statement the next day saying, I will continue to be there to hear those concerns and find solutions to our most pressing problems. We must move forward and I remain committed to our shared concerns. The heated town hall meeting took place right here at the home in United Methodist Church, but the mayor wasn't the only one disrupted by activists. The pastor of this church revealed that he was threatened by members of the Black Lives Matter movement that night. You know, uh, uh, offensive language, you know, uh, being uh, called derogatory names, uh, being cussed at. But I was there. I saw with my own eyes Pastor Sauls be physically threatened with violence in his own church. That's unacceptable for Black Lives Matter activists to threaten anyone with violence. ATVN reached out to leaders of the Black Lives Matter movement, but no one responded to our request. Although many people think this could cause division within the movement, the president of the Compton NAACP says it's not likely to be the case. We are together. Just that how we get the message across is not the same. Now, the pastor of the West Adams Church said he decided against the return visit by the mayor after the idea was leaked online.